going to review some sleek eyeshadow palettes that I own and um, what they look like. I have the limited edition sparkle um, eyeshadow palette. I have the divine mineral based eyeshadow palette um, of war la oh, I don't know how to pronounce this. Basically it looks like this and it came out with um, at the time it came out with a blush and a lip balm but I just got the palette and the last one I got which was about three weeks ago I purchased this which is the Divine Storm palette um, so basically I I haven't I, I was actually quite surprised with myself for not reviewing these in, in detail but hey I'm doing it now I'm a day. so I will start off with my first ever palette that I owned and it was the Sleek Sparkle limited edition and it actually came out last Christmas and basically the minute it came out it was sold out and I was so disappointed when I realised that it was I was literally on the ball waiting for it to be put on the site to be sold and next thing it was like gone I could not purchase it again it was like oh, you know yourself when you really want something and then it goes it's gone like you're like oh, man but anyway I checked up on eBay and it basically you can get it on ebay you can actually still get it on ebay so i purchased this off the ebay site and it actually worked out cheaper for me because the actual palette i think at the time cost around 850 or 750 around that seven euro fifty cent and postage at that time cost around 650 so altogether i would have been paying 15 euro or thereabouts just to buy the palette and that's all i really wanted to off the site but when I got it on eBay, I got a brand new package not even opened, asked questions and everything like that before I purchased, as I always do. And I only paid $8.50, €8.50 plus postage. So it actually worked out an awful lot cheaper for me. But anyway, I'm going on again. Um, I'm going to show you the sleek uh, sparkle palette. And basically, it comes with a nice shadow pal or a nice shadow applicator, which I dump straight away, as I always do. I always dump. I don't like them. Um, it comes with a big mirror, as such, and it's brilliant for travel or anything like that. It's quite handy. It's a huge mirror, actually. It's quite handy. But I'm going to cover the mirror up because I don't want to show you it's what on it. But anyway. Um, it actually comes with all the eyeshadows named as well and it has this little plastic covering over it and I like to keep the plastic covering over it in case any eyeshadows got damaged or whatever at least the, the plastic covering can keep it in place and without further ado I shall show you these beautiful beautiful colours they are just fabulous fabulous absolutely fantastic I actually highly recommend this palette as such because it's perfect for nights out perfect for um christmas time new year's time and basically there's plenty of eyeshadows in there it's going to last you a very long time now obviously i don't use this every day i just look like a disco ball every day but i do use these on special occasions and such and such and such but anyway the eyeshadows are named but i'm not going to name them out you don't really want me to name them out these but i know that this one here is cranberry anyway and it comes with a lovely kind of bright pink color and then there's a nice sparkly um these are all sparkly there's glitter in them but to be honest with you they don't even make a mess while you're applying them they're just absolutely fantastic eyeshadows i highly recommend um sleek eyeshadow palettes they're just incredible but anyway i'm going on again um these shadows you're getting 12 eyeshadows in one palette and they're just absolutely divine they're just amazing Um, you're getting them kind of a i would call this a matte black there's only a tiny tiny bit of sparkle in this i wouldn't even call them sparkle like obviously when you're going to be doing your makeup you're going to be using the other eyeshadows so basically it's just going to be mixed up anyway well i think this black is absolutely incredible Um, will i do some swatches yeah, go on, I'll do some swatches. <laughs> um, I'll do some swatches of this shade here, which is the darker purple on the palette. It's just incredible. Look at that. I hope you can see this now. If you don't see the swatches, I will 100% have these on my blog, and I'll put the link down below. 
I'm just sorry about the lighting. The lighting is not exactly brilliant. Um, I'm trying, I'm still trying to work out the bloody lighting. It's just crazy. Anyway, um, this is the darkest purple. It's absolutely fantastic. Um, I just, you know what I mean. And for the price that you're paying for this palette, like you're getting twelve eyeshadow palettes. Like you're getting twelve eyeshadows for like what well, seven, eight euro. Do you know what I mean? But you're not going to be able to get this on the Sleek website now. You're going to get this on eBay. But make sure that questions on eBay first. That make sure that you know it's legit. That it's not opened or anything like that. But there. I checked even before I done this review they're totally available on on the website but that's what the purple looks like I'm not sure whether you can see that or not but if you do oh, I'm so happy um I'll do a swatch of this a fabulous green is just amazing look at that green just absolutely gorgeous it's like a forest green beautiful there we go I'm sorry about my scarf I hope you can see that scarf um, but that's what the green looks like. Um, I'll show you the black one. There's a tiny, tiny speck of shimmer. But basically what I call this is a matte black. Look how pigmented that is. It's just amazing. I'm not sure whether you can see that or not. Hope you do. Um, and I'll do a swatch of that. It's just amazing. Look at that. Fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. What other colour will I do? Um, I'll do this mad shimmery one. It's a mad shimmery blue. Oh my god. Isn't it beautiful? Isn't it fantastic? Beautiful. Um, and I'll do that here. Oh. Now that's the most powdery one for some reason. And it is the most glittery one out of the whole lot of them. And it's there. But hey. I can't complain. I highly, highly, highly recommend this. If you don't have it. Go and get it. It's perfect, as I said, for night out, Christmas time, New Year's Eve, blah blah blah. If you're into your sparkly kind of nice glittery um eyeshadows, like this is perfect. You're getting your dark smoky eye looks. I don't know. I can't understand about this one though. This one I don't use. It's kind of like a mustardy colour. Hold on, I'll do get a clean finger and then well it is clean, but I mean I'm after swatching the black one there. Um I don't know. I wouldn't really use that as such. Maybe as a highlight. I don't know. It's kind of an odd one out as such. Because it's not even... Um, these three here are mass. But they're not, but the yellow one, I don't know. Maybe some people will use it. But anyway, this is... I give, definitely give this a 10 out of 10. I love it. I love this palette. So next up is the other limited edition eyeshadow palette. Not my favourite as such. It wouldn't be, I wouldn't, like, what way, what way would I put it? I don't, it's not that I don't like it, but I don't use it as often, if you get me. Um, It is a lovely palette. It is the Au Revoir La Pique collection. It is the Paraguaya collection. Um, That one, basically. I'm crap at pronouncing names, and I'm sorry about that, but you'll see the package it's absolutely fantastic i'll have it up on my blog and the spelling of it and everything and um, this too came with an eyeshadow applicator got rid of it as you know that i don't like them and again they're named with the plastic covering over it Just, they're a nice kind of summery spring um colors you can actually use this quite a lot like um with a dark brown or a smoky eye if you want in a nice bright colour on your lid. Absolutely lovely eyeshadow palette. And as you can see I have used it quite a bit like um because I've been experimenting with brighter colours. But I wouldn't as I said, I wouldn't say it's an awful palette, but it wouldn't be my favourite palette. I, I you know. But anyway, um as you can see there's a lot of bright colours in this. Um there's a couple of browns here, uh, there's a couple of matte colours, and then there's a couple of kind of frosty colours, not shimmery, frosty. Um, but quite a lot of matte colours in it. There's, they are fantastic colours though, I'm not, like, look at this, look at my finger, it's completely black, I have to remember not to use that one. Um, I'll just swatch this one. Like, there is some beautiful colours, and even some of them remind you of a blush. Like, obviously... Well, I wouldn't use it as a blush, but, like, if you ever didn't have a blush, you could use one of these colours. Um, this one is a lovely highlight colour. As you can see, it's a nice 
bright highlight colour. Um, I'm not sure whether these are going to come out in swatches or not. No, this one's not going to come out in a swatch. Hold on, I'll swatch this orange one. Um, nicely pigmented, they're really, really soft. This, that's the orange one. I'm sorry, I'm not this near the right now. I just don't want to be showing you my black finger. <laughs> um, nice colour. As you can see, it's quite pigmented. Like, that's amazing pigmentation, I have to say. I'm not sure whether... I don't want to bring it too close in case it just goes all blur. Um, as I said, oh, they're just so... They're seriously creamy. Like, I wouldn't... Like, there's the two darker colours in the in the pack. Um, they're kind of like a grey-brown and a nice grey colour. Um, as I said, they're good colours if you like that. Especially anybody that's kind of medium to dark skin tone would love this. Would love this palette. Um, whereas me, I'm more on the paler side. And I think it's really to do with the eye colours as well. Um, but as I said, it is a good eyeshadow palette. There's a nice gold in this as well. Um, oh my god, I'm after swatching if it's my... Oh, that's been got. There's a nice gold in this as well, as I said. But, like, it is a nice palette, but I wouldn't go repurchasing it again. It's just, I don't know, as I said, it's not my favourite palette as such. But, anywho, um, some of you out there might like it. Then next, last but not least, amazing, amazing palette. And actually, this by Sinead Caddy from the makeup chair if you don't know her um, you got to know her she's really really good I love her to bits I have seen her using quite a um, quite a lot of times actually some sleek palettes as well she actually uses them quite a bit um, and I asked her which one would she recommend and she included the storm palette in her recommendations so of course I went ahead and got it and I've actually seen her a good few times in a good few videos using the storm palette so I knew I wasn't going to be disappointed with this one and I certainly am not disappointed this is definitely another favorite of mine I'm delighted now that I have it in my in my collection I've been using it quite a bit even though it might not look like it but I have been using it quite a bit um, I actually got rid of the plastic thing, so I don't even know what the names of the eyeshadows is, but sure. Um, so this is what the palette looks like. As you can see, it's an absolutely fabulous, fabulous palette. It has a lovely amount of neutral colours, um, some gold shades, uh, not at all sparkly. There's no kind of glitter in it. It's more kind of frosty colours. Um, some matte colours. Uh, I use kind of mix this one and this one for my eyebrows Um, this is such a handy palette especially if you're going to travel or anything like that you have so many looks in this palette alone Um, you can have a, a smoky eye look in this you can just have a normal if you just wanted to use a one eyeshadow or if you wanted to do um, a smoky eye you have it all here in this palette. It's just Absolutely. if you like your neutrals and if you do like a dark smoky eye, um, you also have your eyebrow colours and there's like it's just amazing aid for recommending this. I am not disappointed, and if I do run out of this, I'll definitely purchase this again. Um, how long do I kind of swap here and see tonight? I hope I'm still in focus. Um, I'm gonna swap over. I have to uh, show you some of these swatches. They're just amazing. I swatched this one here absolutely amazing pigmentation like look at that isn't that just there. amazing and i will do the swatch of this beautiful brown color it's just gorgeous absolutely gorgeous there's kind of like a t slight tint of gold in it oh, i am just in love with this palette i think the pigmentation is serious and um, it's no wonder it sinead loves this palette um i'll swatch this one here as well oh just amazing 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 look at that absolutely fantastic colors i just i'm in love with this um you have a matte black as well there's the black absolutely serious pigmentation and um, look at that just i swatched that one already i don't think i did just beautiful gold colors i'm not going to swatch the whole lot because this video will go on forever but i hope you can see them swatches i hope so you see them absolutely absolutely amazing 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 i love this palette so um definitely go and buy this and I, this is available on the sleep website because it's a permanent palette so 
Um, I hope this was helpful to you all. I hope you enjoyed this review. And um, if you have any questions at all, please don't hesitate to ask. Check out my blog for close up swatches and brighter pictures and whatever, whatnot. I'm just not sure whether these swatches came out properly or not. But there's the swatches. Um, I hope you're all well. And if you have any questions at all, just comment down below. And please rate, comment, and subscribe. Um, if you have any requests, just let me know anything at all. If if I'm able to do them, I will do them. I'll let you know. Okay, until next time, talk to you soon. Take care and bye.